Take a look at this. So this is surveillance footage of a woman robbing a man in the middle of a seizure. You can see his feet on the ground as she stands over him looking through his wallet. According to reports, the woman allegedly took a credit card, put the wallet back in his pocket, walked away while he was still on the ground, seizing. They then say, the police said that later on his stolen credit card was used for purchases. She was ultimately arrested on charges of unlawful possession of credit cards. Shame card on you! Stuff. And you know what's crazy? The, the worst part is the victim was a certified nurse assistant who helps others, and then, I, I mean, I, who, why, who does this stuff? I mean, it's You're evil. You're to help someone. It's person. evil, but you know, the Epilepsy Foundation says that a lot of times when people are having seizures, they get robbed. This commonly happens. People are, that's evil. It's disgusting, whoever said that. It is disgusting to take advantage of someone who's having a seizure because, look, th most people are very frightened by seizures, rightly so. And, and I don't know how many people in this room are watching have witnessed one, but obviously your true. brain's electrical system is literally going haywire and sending signals to your body, and, and it's, it's an uncontrollable event. And in this moment, especially with generalized seizure, the individual may have no idea what's going on. And, when they, and then also when they, when they do stop seizing, there's this post-ictal period where you can still get robbed or you can still get taken advantage exactly. of. Exactly, they don't know what's going on, they don't know what happened. Exactly, and sometimes they have warning signs that it's about to happen, like they may see strange light or smell or like things like that, but sometimes they have no clue that it's coming and it right. just comes in, out of in the, the case you can, If you're epileptic and you know one's coming, then you can put yourself in a safe place, but if you don't, probably the biggest risk is falling and yeah. injuring yourself from the fall. And it's yeah. also why someone with poorly controlled seizures, they're not driving cars, they're not supposed to go swimming unattended because obviously this can happen at any point in time.